MSB Docs offers 21 CFR Part 11 compliant electronic signatures tailored specifically for pharma and CROs. This solution ensures a legally recognized FDA compliant method for secure and auditable signatures, satisfying the strict regulatory requirements of the life sciences industry. With MSB Docs, applying your 21 CFR Part 11 compliant signature is easy and secure. If a document custodian sends you a 21 CFR compliant signature request, you'll receive an email. Click the link to start the signing process. Depending on the configuration and your account status, one of four scenarios will occur. If Easy Sign is enabled and you have a registered account, you'll be taken directly to the document. Review the document and click Sign to begin the signing process. Accept the consent. Fill in all the tags that require your attention. You can use the previous and next buttons to move from tag to tag within the document. When filling out a signature tag, you'll notice that it has four components, your signature, printed name, date and timestamp, and signing reason. These four components are required for your signature to be compliant with 21 CFR Part 11. Click on the signature. If the custodian has pre-selected a signing reason when sending you the EPAC, you won't need to choose one. Otherwise, select a signing reason from the drop-down menu. Once you have completed all the required tags, a Finish button will appear. Click Finish to finalize your signature. An authentication pop-up will appear. You can enter optional comments, which will be recorded in the document's audit trail. Enter your email address as your username and enter your MSB Docs password. Then click Sign to apply your signature. It's that easy. If Easy Sign is enabled and you do not have a registered account, when you click the email link, you will be prompted to set an MSB password. Set your password and continue. Then choose how you want your signature to appear. MSB Docs will save your signature preference, so that next time you don't have to choose. Review the document and begin the signing process as in the previous example by filling in all required tags. Once all tags are complete, click Finish. On the authentication window, enter your email address and the MSB password which you set, and click Sign to apply your signature. You can now log into MSB Docs with your email address and password if you wish to access your account and documents you previously signed. If Easy Sign is disabled and you have a registered account, clicking the email link will bring you to the MSB Docs login page. Log in and open the EPAC. Then you can review and sign the EPAC in the same manner as demonstrated before. If Easy Sign is disabled and you do not have a registered account, click the link in the signature request. Enter your email address and click Next. A welcome email will be sent to you to register your account. Click the link in the email and then enter and confirm your desired password. Once you have set your password, you may now log into MSB Docs. Log in and set the appearance of your signature. Then you can review and sign the EPAC in the same manner as demonstrated before. Regardless of configuration or account status, MSB Docs makes applying a 21 CFR compliant signature straightforward and secure. Thank you for watching.